your your live. Okay. Um, so zero to seventy-five. So I go to zero on the x-axis. Is that right, Ishmael? Yeah. yeah. Okay. You might want to get your ruler. Depends. Okay. And you go up to seventy-five, which is roughly. So we're talking about halfway between seventy and eighty. So there. Okay. The next one, Marvin's. So that's that one done. Okay. And what's the time? So I start the x-axis. So what's the time? One. Yeah. And then I'm going up to 64. So there. Okay, good. So that's that point done. Uh, Anna, the next one. Very good. So two. And I'm going up to there since so we're in 54. Excellent. Good work. Uh, Vanessa, the next one. So that's done. Yeah, three. Okay, good. And now I'm going up to see where is we're in 43. And there. Excellent. Um, Lorcan, the next one. Okay, so four, and it's the same as the last time. Okay, very good. Leah, next one. Five forty-three. So the same again. That's going to be the exact same space. The next one is the same again. I'm just going to do it. Six forty-three. Okay. The next one is the same again. Seven forty-three. The next one after that, then Ashley. Eight thirty-two. Good. And there. Uh, the next one, Kevin. Oh yeah, sorry. Okay, nine twenty-two. Yeah. So these lines have cut off me there. It's right there. Okay. And um, and then the very <coughs> last one then. Uh, Andrea. Ten and ten. Okay, so it's just there. Okay, all right, and again, then you're just going to get your whatever you want to use. Oh, I have a color pen. I seem to have lost all my pens. Okay, so I'll use highlighter. So we're going to get the highlighter. Join the first lines. Stop because obviously now we've got a horizontal line, and then join the lines down again. Okay. Happy enough with that? Okay, so there, that's it. That's your graph done. Okay, most common mistake is that people forget this point here. They always forget the one at zero for some reason. Don't forget, if it's in the table, there has to be a point on the graph. Um, explain the shape of the graph that you've obtained. So explain this again to me. Shh, shh, David. Yeah, so temperature, yeah, so you're right, so you're starting at the very start, so as temperature was dropping, okay, so temperature was dropping over time, and then when it got to three minutes, what happened? It was, yeah, excellent, so then it starts to change state until seven minutes, and then, and then it starts to cool again. Okay, so we say that again. So over time, up as far as three minutes, Okay, it's starting to cool, the acid is cooling down. When it hits three minutes, it changes state. So it's latent heat, no change in temperature, it's changing state. And then when it hits seven minutes, it starts to cool again. And then, there we go at the end of ten minutes. I would have kept going. Okay? the melting point. So the melting point again is when if an ice is melting point it changes from solid to liquid. So Aaron what's the melting point there? When's the changing state? 43 yeah 43 degrees. Does everyone see that? So it's wherever the melting point is wherever the straight line is. 
okay so because it's not changing state so that's the line there so that's 43 degrees you can even check back into your table if you're not sure of the figure okay if you look back at the table again here's 43 degrees it hasn't changed that, that, that must have been the melting point that must have been when it was changing state question